Hi, this is Thunder Yee from BorderWork.com and today we're do, doing a full look at Facebook 2.3 for Windows Phone. This is the latest update to the Facebook app itself on Windows Phone and you can see uh, huge improvements all over and also similarities to what you have with the Facebook page that it is right now. So the first thing you note is you do have a banner image like you do have with the new timeline and actually it uh, has multiple images and you can change the banner images and so on and so forth. Uh, before we continue here with the home, um, the home page itself, let's just go uh, in here, check out the, you can refresh settings and you can change your banner image. So we're going to settings. Um, you have ability to catch um, whatever you're doing, turn on and off banner images, run on the lock screen, allow Facebook to detect your location. Push notifications, so you have push notifications for toast and tiles and you can select whichever notification you want. And of course about, um, that's pretty much it there. Now heading here, now this is your, um, when you turn the app on and you sign in, uh, your first slide here in your tile format, you do have the ability to put in what's on your mind so you can update your status. You can check your profile, friends, your messages nearby, and scroll down. Everything you have in your Facebook uh, layout is actually here. So you can see your groups, your pages, and also go into your photos and your notes. Also, you can see at the very top there, you can also access uh, your friends list or basically your pending friends list, your messages, and your notification. The next tile here brings up our news feed and you can see my banner image has changed also again. So it's different banner images on each uh, segment there. And I can go through my news feed here. And also in this section, uh, besides just refreshing uh, filter uh, my uh, news feed, I can also check in, add and you know take photos here as well as log out and change the banner image. So I'll go through the next one and this is all my notifications. And you can see my notifications, it has a tile of its own as well as I can also tap there to check my notifications which is pretty much the same thing anyway and um, I go if I go go across here again sorry um, this is my photos uh, this is just photos from uh, friends who've posted photos so you can see photos you can jump in and check those out and of course back to your main page here again so uh, it's very simple. It's very similar to what you have with Facebook and also matches the other Facebook apps on, uh, that have been updated on Android, I believe iOS, I'm not exactly sure. Um, but one thing to note though, the messaging, which I don't like so much, if you go into messaging, either you tap messages here, you tap messages there, what you find out is that your messages are not in the same order you have, say, on your Facebook app on Android or, or, or uh, on the website. So I have all these messages and you see some names, but I don't exactly know who I'm messaging to. The ones with my name there, of course, doesn't actually point to the fact that uh, that's actually a different conversation with someone. It's just showing my name as the last piece of that conversation. So that's something that hopefully they'll change to just put the name of the person you're you know, conversing with so you know exactly who that conversation is with. You can pin those conversations, you can add new ones if you want to. So that's the only thing with the application I say that um, I think needs to be fixed. It's just the way the messages are structured so that it, uh, it you just know who you were talking to because some of them just show you show you as the last message. Uh, but that's pretty much it. It's very nice, a good addition and, and uh, a huge improvement from the Facebook app on um, was previously on Windows Phone. So if you guys have any questions or any comments about uh, Facebook application version 2.3 on Windows Phone, let us know. Uh, don't forget to subscribe to all our pages on Twitter, Facebook, and YouTube, as well as Google+. It's Border Work, 2 O's, all the links are down below. So this is Thundee saying thank you, and always enjoy entertainment.